Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for July 25th of 2022 well, it is titled Find the New Moon. So what do we see here? Well, it is an image of our moon and you may not see it right away, but take some time and look there and see if you can pick out the very thin crescent shape of our moon here. Now our moon goes through a set of phases. The phases occur because the moon shines by reflected sunlight. So half of the surface of the moon is illuminated at any given time and half of the moon surface points towards Earth. So the phase that we see is a combination of those two. If the entire illuminated surface points towards Earth, then we would have a full moon. If none of it points towards Earth, then we would see a new moon. And that's what we're very close to here is a new moon. And the new moon will not always be completely unilluminated. That would only occur if things are lined up just perfectly. There would often be a very thin sliver of light, very tiny, almost impossible to see. That would occur because the moon is a little bit tilted. Its orbit is tilted a little bit relative to the Earth and Sun plane. And therefore, the moon is a little bit above that. A portion of it could still remain illuminated, even when it is in the general direction of our sun. So here again, you can look and see, uh, perhaps find our moon in this image. Now full moon and new moon are just two of the phases that we see. The moon also goes through a crescent phase, which is in a way what we see here. Crescent phase occurs when the moon is in roughly the same direction of the sky as the sun. And when it is roughly opposite, we would see a gibbous phase, which means it's more than half illuminated. So a crescent would be less than half illuminated. Gibbous phase would be more than half illuminated. And of course, in between the border between those two would be the first quarter phase as the moon gets more and more illuminated each night. And the third quarter phase as the moon is getting less and less illuminated each night as it goes through this entire cycle each month. So if you've had a chance to look here, you may be able to see that thin crescent of the moon uh, towards the center of the image a little bit to the right of center and almost in the center of the sky portion and a little bit to the right of center of the image, you would be able to see a very thin crescent shape, which is the very, very uh, uh, thin part of the moon that was visible when this image was taken. So that was our picture of the day for July 25th of 2022. It was titled Find the New Moon. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture, previewed to be Noctilucent Comet. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day, everyone, and I will see you in class.